Hey, planner buddy. Hey guys, welcome back to another video. This week I am using the Gardening One sticker book by the Happy Planner for my weekly spread. This is a new sticker book that just came out in uh, January, I believe. And it came out in the bloom box, actually. And I'm loving it. Loving the bloom box, loving the storage boxes. It is a super cute, super floral uh, happy box. So I decided to try out the gardening sticker book. I'm not a gardener, so of course I'm not going to be using this for any gardening purposes. But I wanted to see if I can pull out a spread from the sticker book. And I was happy to find out that it actually had checklists on it because um, I had chosen it and then I realized that I didn't know what was in it exactly. So here I am setting up my usual checklists and I have decided to completely switch over to this uh, layout where my checklists go diagonal instead of checkered. I really like how it looks and I think it works out a little better for me. So here I am just flipping through the sticker book. I flipped through this so many times. I also like uh, these layered boxes that it has. This sticker book also has a lot of different kinds of florals that we haven't seen before in any other sticker book before and the colors are a bit different. I don't know, they remind me a bit of like vintage vibes, you know, along those lines. And for this spread, I wasn't really going for a specific theme. At first, I wanted to go for the foil green that um, I saw, like the one in the weekend. But I realized that it didn't have too much of that foil green. So that kind of threw me off a little bit. So then I went for the florals. And I do like how it turned out, but I can see how it might be maybe a little too busy for my usual taste, but it was a good um, chance to experiment with, you know, a little out of the norm. I also, you know, experimented a little more with different shapes, like those, hmm, I don't know what to call them, those boxes, and um, a little bit more of layering and getting out of the usual um, set boxes in the vertical layout spread. I also like that this sticker book came with these little circle heart icon stickers. They worked really well when I needed to balance out the colors a little more since this spread didn't have like one specific color so I needed to balance out the greens, the light purples, the pinks and these were perfect for that. So I think we're nearing the end of the spread, just adding some final touches of floral decor here and there. But I wanted to remind you guys about our monthly challenge, which is the 10 minute spread with the Dream Seeker sticker book. If you really want to try it out, tag us on Instagram. We'd love to see your spreads. And I want to thank you guys for all the support that you've shown us thus far. We've really enjoyed talking to all of you and just being a part of the amazing planner community. So here I'm just adding the final, final stickers. And this is what my final spread looked like. I am pleased with how it turned out. It's a little different, a little out of my comfort zone. But you know, that's something good. We need to get out of the comfort zone a little bit. So make sure to check out my Planner Buddies video this week. And we hope to see you in our future videos as well. Bye!